Troy, this is just a really peculiar situation. The school's head teacher tells us that 42 students and four staff members are currently waiting in New York to get their emergency documents after they say 41 of their passports were destroyed by the hotel. The group is from Bar Beacon Head School in Walsall, England. They were here on a ski trip which started February 17th and they were supposed to go home on the 25th. An itinerary for the trip that was posted on the school's website notes that students were staying here at the Kankamagas Resort. The hotel told us they have no comment to share about this situation. And so right now, the school says those kids do have a place to stay in New York, but funds for their trip are starting to run low. One parent we spoke with told us the situation has been incredibly scary, and we tried to get some context on how this might have happened. And one local resort manager we spoke with said it's not unusual for hotels to hold passports of school groups in an effort to keep them safe. We always know it's a very um, risky situation with their passports. So when they arrive at the hotel, the chaperones collect all their passports and we put them into a uh, safety deposit box. And the school tells us they're hoping those emergency documents will be ready by tomorrow so those kids can fly home on Tuesday. We're live in Lincoln tonight, Ariel Metropolis, WMUR News 9.